Hello and thank you for joining us. I'm Brad with Mandico. This tutorial will cover the pre-delivery inspection for the Mandico inline land roller. Be sure to use the pre-delivery inspection form provided at mandico.com. The link for the form is available in the description below. Thanks again for watching. Your inline land roller will come with an updated operator's manual. Be sure it is in the canister and you review the manual prior to operating the machine. When first received, it is important to thoroughly wash your Mandico machine. Be sure not to forget to wash the cylinder shafts. Cleaning the machine removes salts and other debris from shipping that can cause rusting and pitting. When you receive the unit, it is important you conduct a walk around check of the machine. Starting at the hitch, work your way to the rear of the machine. Items to inspect are paint nicks and scratches, fastener tightness, hydraulic crimps and connections for leaks and tightness, hydraulic hoses for cracks, leaks, cuts, chaffing and rubbing, as well as electrical wiring for cracks, chaffing, rubbing, and a proper connection. As you move along the machine, be sure to check for any other items that may be loose or missing like chains, holders, and cylinder stops. Also inspect that cotter pins are bent and secure, and hoses include color indicators for identification. Verify safety decals are not peeling or missing. Be sure to verify all grease fittings are in place and lights are in good condition. On the end of the drum, check if the nuts and bolts, fittings, washers, and roller bung plugs are tight. Make sure the slow moving vehicle sign is secure, the frame is level, and the top pin is secure. Next, move on to identifying the lubrication points and verifying all points have been greased from factory. If unable to confirm, if a grease point has been greased, it is recommended to add one to two shots of grease or until grease can be observed. Please note, the land roller drum bearing should not be given more than one shot of grease. Over greasing the drum bearing can cause the bearing seal to be pushed out, causing premature failure. Prior to greasing, be sure to clean off the fittings. Grease points can be found in the operator's manual. For the inline manual, these would include wheel axle arms, frame pivot pin, hitch jack, and land roller drum bearings. Inspect that all wheel lug nuts are present and recheck wheel lug nut torque. Torque nuts to 133 foot pounds. At this time, also verify dust caps are secure on hubs. Next, check tire pressures. Tires should be set at 100 psi. Finally, verify all electrical and hydraulic functions operate correctly. Refer to the operator's manual on how to safely operate the Mandico inline land roller. Note that the cylinder stops should be placed on the provided storage bar when not in use. The bar can be found on the frame in front of the axles. If the machine will be stored after the pre-delivery inspection, be sure to follow the operator's manual instructions on storing the unit. Pay particular attention to apply rust inhibitor to hydraulic cylinder rams to prevent rusting. As previously noted, it is important the machine has been properly washed prior to storage.
Thank you for watching this video on how to complete a pre-delivery inspection on the inline land roller. Subscribe to Matico on YouTube or follow us on social media for more information about our agricultural implements and upcoming tutorials on how to care for your Matico equipment.